So I'm making a video about how to find work and make money in Halifax, Nova Scotia. But this video also works for students anywhere in the world. So if you're not from Halifax, it doesn't matter. If you're interested in finding work, getting a job, learning marketing, moving to Halifax, or just coming to visit Canada, hit that subscribe button below to get updates about my videos and turn on notifications because they'll help you every single day. There's this funny thing about finding work in Halifax. It can seriously suck. Trust me, I feel you. You're coming here and you're afraid you're not going to find work. You know work isn't so easy to find and you're like, oh my god, it's so much for me to even go there in the first place. Why can't I just get a job like that? How come even if you take initiative, you call employers, I don't get a call back? And the reason for that is look at the city. There's hundreds of thousands of students in this city uh, in one way or another and they're all looking for jobs. So you, my friends, need to differentiate yourselves. So I've worked online for the past few years in Halifax and that's helped me get my groceries and make a living in this city while going to school and I work totally and exclusively online which saved me time I could you know crank out all of my schoolwork and then work on a project and then go to bed it was not easy it was hard let me tell you that but it was way better because I got to call the shots I did not have to go outside into the cold and walk to work or wait for a bus it was fantastic I went outside when I wanted to if I wanted to I love the outside I just don't like working for other employers in, in another setting particularly there's a couple of jobs that I, I have right now that I love uh, but in terms of working at like Tim Hortons or something, I couldn't see myself doing that. So I never did do that. I did part-time jobs that I love like DJing and um, doing uh, marketing work for people and working at a dealership. Those were fun stuff. So I always limited it to that and I worked at home for the rest of the time and I don't regret it. I had such a great time working at home and I recommend you do it as well. So if you want to work online, I recommend checking out some of my other videos but also researching it. Start with these websites. Fiverr.com, Freelancer.com and if you can teach things, if you know any skills, and I know a lot of you who watch my videos know web development, you know web design they sell a lot you know you can make a course on a website called udemy.com I'm putting that in the description as well I usually put them on screen I'm not going to do that for this video look in the description click that I know some people who uh, from different places in the world I know this guy from Bangladesh made a web development course in English English wasn't his first language he made about 1,000 US dollars in his first month he's on to his second month and he's just doing amazingly another another guy did ROS basics robotic systems or something like that. He made over a thousand US in his first month. So go ahead and do that. You're going to build up passive income. Teaching lessons online, you make the lesson, you go away, and then it just starts racking in revenue. So that's what I recommend you do. Um, obviously make that resume, send it to people, but try to work online as you're doing that. Find a fallback. Even before you move to Canada, try to set up an online business. That is where the world is going. Halifax, in terms of jobs, your prospects look pretty good, uh, but it is hard. It's very much an insider uh, employment sort of situation. So if you don't know anybody, it's going to be a little harder because there's so many students. I'm telling you that, but it's a great city because you can make more than them and stand out to work online. It's one of the best cities in Canada to work online, I am serious because all the opportunities there right now and you will really have the most con convenient schedule as a student and how you'll have a lot of time to do what you love. Go ahead and try it and let me know if you have any questions. I'll make a video about any of the online questions you have.